Next model of the respiratory system is this model of the larynx with part of the trachea. The larynx is also known as your voice box. The larynx is attached to the rest of your throat by this bone. This bone is called the hyoid bone. It's that one horseshoe shaped bone. This tube down here is the trachea. The trachea is reinforced with rings of cartilage that are shaped like a C. You can see that each ring of cartilage is open in the back and these tracheal rings are often called cartilaginous rings. So here's one, two, three. There are many tracheal rings. The trachea is attached to the larynx and the larynx is made out of many cartilage. The ones you need to know for 120 are the largest one here. This one is called the thyroid cartilage and the thyroid cartilage is superior to this cartilage which is called the cricoid cartilage. The cricoid cartilage attaches the larynx to the trachea. If we look at the posterior aspect of the larynx, you can see that in the back, the cricoid cartilage looks a little bit bigger from behind, but it is the last of the laryngeal cartilages before we get to the trachea. Now that we're looking at the posterior aspect of the larynx, you can see this structure, which is called the epiglottis, the epiglottis. In this model, the epiglottis the cartilage of the epiglottis is still covered by the tissue and it forms this flap. The epiglottis is the guardian of the opening through the larynx and this opening through the larynx is called the glottis. Let's take the larynx apart and let's look at the inside. Now you can see that the epiglottis has got this blue epiglottic cartilage and you can see the inside of the trachea. And then we can see the vocal cords which are also known as vocal folds. And in our model you can see that they're painted with a little bit of white. This is the vocal fold and just superior to the vocal fold is the false vocal cord false vocal cord, which is also known as the vestibular fold. Let's look at this one with the numbers on it. Here we've got the true vocal cord or vocal fold. Here we have the false vocal cord or vocal, false vocal fold. The epiglottis, the epiglottic cartilage, the cricoid cartilage, the thyroid cartilage, and here we've got the tracheal rings.